One of the audience members, she had a tenant who had a three-year lease. The lease expired and then the tenant decided he wasn't going to move out. So she was wondering how to get him out. Not only was he holding over beyond the lease, but he wasn't paying rent. There's certain judges that like things done a certain way. Luckily, the district that this woman was in, the judge is super chill. And so when she goes to fight this eviction, she's not going to have a lot of trouble, especially if the tenant doesn't show up. The judge is just going to grant her possession, likely without her having to show any documentation or anything like that because it'll all already be in her filing with the court but then there's other judges who definitely want to hear your story why you're evicting them they want to see every piece of paper they want to see all your documentation as to why you're evicting the tenant especially if you're asking for payment from the tenant in back rent or attorney's fees or filing fees or anything along those lines so even if you know the process just having the experience of knowing how these judges operate can get sometimes come in handy